Hey everyone, in today's video I'll be covering the best loadout to use to get you through the highest difficulty of Helldive, so let's dive into it. Starting off with the weapons, there's two that stand out quite a bit which is nice so now you have some options in case you can't get one. The first one being the SMG 37 Defender. I know right, not something you'd expect. It's got the highest damage in comparison to all the other assault rifles so not too bad off the start. The fire rate is a bit slower to balance out its higher damage and normally this would be seen as something that holds it back but actually no. I found it to be really good. It just helps you save ammo and stops you from overshooting your targets when they're already dead. Especially since it's got a bit more damage, guys drop fairly quickly. The weapon traits for it, light armor penetration, so nothing special and being one-handed. Pretty much if you're ever carrying one of those briefcases during a mission, like when you have to drop it off somewhere, instead of switching to your pistol to shoot, you can still use the SMG while carrying the package. This also works with the riot shield, which I thought was pretty cool. Not too helpful during the bug missions, but definitely during the automatrons. One of the big biggest things I like the most for the SMG is the ability to jog and shoot at the same time. If you're using a shotgun or an assault rifle, your character ends up slow walking in order to shoot, and if you're being chased by a horde of bugs, the last thing you want to do is slow down. Very good weapon all around, something you should definitely try out. And the other weapon for a primary weapon is the sickle. Very solid assault rifle, high rate of fire, good amounts of damage, and being able to save ammo by letting the weapon cool down instead of reloading it. However, you need to buy the cutting edge pack which can be a bit of a grind to get, hence why I have two options here. For the pistol, there's only one option to pick and that's the P19 Redeemer. It's better than the starter pistol and every other pistol in almost every way. It's got 60 damage per shot which is funny because it does more than the assault rifles, holds 31 bullets and it has a crazy good fire rate perfect for melting any bugs that jump on you. And if you don't like the fast fire rate, it can also be switched to semi-auto to help save ammo in case you're on your last mag or if you just don't like the recoil on it. Grenade wise is nothing special. I just use the standard G12 explosive one. It's perfect for taking out bug nests whereas the impact grenade can be a bit difficult for that but it is easier to blow up bugs in front of you though and blow yourself up too. Anyways moving on to the armor the bone snapper is what you're going to need. It's in the medium category so you don't get any extra speed buffs like the light armor and you're also not getting any extra protection like the heavy armor but you're also not getting any of their negative effects either like the light armor offering less protection and the heavy armor offering less speed. Regardless, that's not the important part to it. It's actually the armor's passive buff. You get an extra two stims in your inventory and it increases the duration of the stims healing effect by two seconds. Two seconds doesn't sound like a lot of time, but when you compare it to the bugs or robots killing you in less than half of that time, the two seconds of extra healing helps out quite a bit. And again, having two more stims on hand is really helpful as well. For the helmets and capes, there isn't anything that offers any buffs yet, but most likely in the future, there will be some. Alright, on to the main stuff here, the stratagems. In every loadout, I'm always taking the 500 kilogram bomb. This thing can one-shot every enemy in the game as long as they're in the blast radius. If you upgrade your ship's module, you can call in two of these before it goes on cooldown, which is really nice. Obviously, saving this for the Bio Titan, tanks, and depending on the situation, chargers, but I don't usually use it on chargers, it's kind of overkill for them. The second stratagem, the mech suit. The amount of support you can provide with this thing is insane. If you know how to use it. What I mean by this is you have to target certain weak spots on enemies to not only kill them instantly but also save ammo and maximize on how many of those strong units you can kill before you run out. For example, the bio spewers. If you shoot them directly in the face with a rocket, they will drop instantly and all that would take is one rocket. In comparison to shooting three or four into its body and legs, you have 14 rockets total. In theory, you could kill 14 bio spewers with this one stratagem. Obviously, in a perfect situation, Situation, but realistically, you could probably kill around 4 to 7, which is still a lot. And then for the chargers, you don't want to just sink as many rockets into their head as you can. All you have to do is shoot one missile either into its right or front left leg, destroying the armor on it, and then shooting it for a couple of seconds with the minigun. It kills them quickly and saves on both types of ammo. So don't focus on its ass, it takes way more shots and explosives to kill it from there. The third stratagem I use is the orbital rail cannon. You toss it near a bio spewer or a charger and it's guaranteed to get hit by a really powerful bullet or missile or something. It just does a lot of damage instantly, so it's good for taking out the bigger guys. And the last strategy 
stratagem to use is going to be the arc charger. You're pretty much using these when all the other stratagems are on cooldown, so you always have something on hand to deal with the much stronger guys. And the arc charger is generally good all around. You can kill multiple of the weaker guys easily, you can trip the armor off of a charger, and still be able to kill a vial spewer. The main drawback to it is it will take more shots to kill the stronger guys, however, you do have unlimited ammo to go with it. Just be careful not to fry your teammates when shooting this. Little side note, it completely ignores armor, so that's something you never have to worry about. And last but not least, the ship modules. When you're unlocking these, the first thing you want to max out is the hangar. This is going to reduce the cooldown on the 500 kilogram bomb stratagem and give you an additional bomb to call in before it goes on cooldown. This also includes other stratagems that involve calling in a jet. After that, you should at least buy the first one in the patriotic administration, so when you call in the railgun, it drops with full ammo. Now I'm just going to show you guys how well this build performs on the Helldive difficulty with randoms. Hope this helped. Okay, so first thing we're doing right off the bat, we're getting the Patriot suit. And we're also tossing down the Arc Thrower. We just want to have all of our weapons ready, so when we run out of ammo on the Patriot, we can just instantly pull out the Arc Thrower. I really hope that kills that. I don't think it will. Give me the gun, please. I'm going to do a little 180 quick scope. I am. Okay. I missed with the missile. You still got the kill. Uh, I guess that, yeah, that charger died. Another charger. Missed its leg. No, I got its leg. Okay, I guess the impact killed it. Uh, let's see. Okay, these weaker guys, I don't want to waste too much ammo on them because... My teammates on the ground can take them easily. The commanders, I'll take these guys out because they'll spawn more guys. And they're somewhat tough. Like, I wouldn't put them on the same level as a charger, but... Oh, definitely stalkers, though. These, you want to get rid of as soon as you see them. They'll kill your teammates easily. And also you, too, if a couple of them pile up. Oh, yeah, and you can snipe those with this. It's so nice, because you definitely need to have uh, clear visibility. Okay, uh, don't move. Got his leg, and now we just shred it. See, just like that. Balls, one missile, and a little bit of the minigun. Let's see, I guess we're going for that objective. Is there a charger over there? I guess not. Thought I heard something. Oh, lots of stalkers. And you can't mark them either, which is kind of annoying because you can't let your team know. You just gotta, like, take them out right when you see them. But yeah, these guys, I would definitely recommend using the minigun to rip apart. Okay. Nice and easy. Yeah, let's head to the next objective. You also got to be careful too, you don't want these small guys to constantly hit your mech either, or else then they'll slowly build up damage and then you get to a point where they'll kill you. And you'll be like, oh, well I didn't get to fully use the mech, which is a little annoying, but you know, that just happens. In case somebody wants that. Alright, I guess you guys handle behind, I'll handle up front, even though there's nothing in front. How far is the objective? Damn. We're going on a hike. Come on, you guys. We'll deal with those guys when they catch up to us. So let's see. Two chargers have died. And one, uh, what's it called? Bile Titan. And we're at eight missiles and 655 ammo. I definitely could have used the missiles a little bit better. I mean, I just could have had better aim, but you know. That's just how it goes sometimes. Uh, let me just... Mute you. Nothing personal. See, and down here is a perfect spot to use... The, what's it called? The 500 kilogram bar. Just hop out of the... Yeah. Watch it drop. Two bot, uh, two... Blah, blah, blah. Two charger kills, just like that. I would say that was worth it. Oh, okay. I guess it didn't kill them. Odd. 
Okay, I did ship out his armor, though. That's another thing, too. Sometimes you want to jump out of the mech and use your, uh, your airstrikes just to make the mech last a little bit longer. Okay, let's get... Did we get his leg? Yeah, we did. Then we ripped apart his leg. Nice and easy. You also want to keep an eye on your teammates, too. You don't want them to just die. Okay, yeah, you can taser those guys to death. Let's move on the objective. There's also the stomping ability, too, so you can kind of, like, melee these guys to death, but you can also just kind of walk on them and they die. Just squish them. See, so right here, no need. Just walk, step, crunch. Okay. Let me not get too carried away with the crunching people. Start to help my team out a little bit. Get rid of you guys. Okay, I'm going to leave these guys to you, and I'm going to help these guys out. Perfect. I see that there. I'll go deal with that. Actually, this is perfect. Let me go toss out the other 500 kilogram bomb. So then that's going to rearm while I'm using the Titan. So when I come, or Titan, the mech. Oh wait, it didn't go off. That's not good. Please don't land in the water. There we go. You also want to make sure there's no one around you when you get out. Did that kill him? No, that did not kill him. Come on, hit the head. Stop missing. There we go. Yeah, again, I could have used this mech much better. But that's okay. I got a pretty good amount of kills still. Alright, let's get out of here. And make sure we don't step on our teammates. And we gotta head all the way around. So I got one missile left. I can either destroy a charger's leg and then just shred them to pieces with the minigun. Or I could try my luck to try to snipe one of the bio titans in the face. I think I'd prefer to use this on one of the chargers, but... I don't know. We'll just see what comes, what comes our way. Go watch our teammates back. Yeah, it looks like we're using it on a charger. Don't want to waste a shot here. Come on, give me give me something clean. There we go. Please, please stop climb, climbing that like Spider-Man. Really not giving me a clear shot. Oh, he didn't die? I'm just wasting the rest of these bullets. Okay, three shots left. Might as well jump out. All right, boys, make a run for it. See, and now I just switched to using the... What is it called? The arc charger? I don't know, just the taser. And it just rips right through them. Uh, I don't want to use this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got some distance. See, and it just chains to, like, the guys behind them, beside them. It's so good. Where is that Bile Spewer? Or Titan? I like Bile Titan a little bit more. I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. Uh, yeah, let's just use that. Oh, it's... Yeah. Beautiful. Oh, we've got to get to the objective. What are we doing? Do I need ammo? No, I'm pretty good on ammo. Actually, I think I will take this quickly. Quickly. Grab my arc charger back. Nice. It also doesn't hurt to, like, pick up other... Other people's weapons and stuff. Well, not weapons. I guess it's a... Radagem. Like, if it's there. Ooh. 
Okay, exosuit's got six minutes. Uh, be careful with this. Nice. Oh, there's another one. Hey. See, when they run past you, you know you can't, you can't just let this go because it's gonna, it's gonna get them. He dead? Yeah, he dead. He dead. Another one. Crazy. Days are him to death. And another. They just keep coming. See, look at that quad kill right there. Easy. Six piece. Give me a six piece chicken nugget from McDonald's. I think that's it for that. And I'm pretty sure there's a charger over here. Nope, no charger, but tons of guys. Toss some nades. Nope, there is a charger. Um, I also don't see the need to use the 500 kilogram bomb. It's kind of overkill. Boom. Nice. I didn't want to shoot a second round there in case it arcs to him. Hey, I think I tasered a civilian. My bad. I know we're trying to rescue you and all, but like sometimes, you know, just shit happens. Is that 500? Yeah, 500. Two 500s, okay. First one didn't get him, the second one definitely did. Damn, there's a lot of these chargers. But we're taking them out very quickly, though. Like, they're not swarming us or anything. Let's go into the way. Just toss that down. Okay, everybody back up. I don't know what's happening to my guy. Shaboom. Climb up. Uh, do I have my mech suit? Almost. Actually, not almost. Got like another three minutes. Hey, watch out, little people. I guess they're regular sized people. Alright, you get those guys. I'll try to pick them off from a distance. Not from a distance, but from up here. Oi! So easy to use. This thing is fun. I think it's just fun because you just get multi kills like it's nothing. Okay, run, little people. Got about 17 more of you guys to go. Check the map. Nothing on here. Nothing coming from the front. Or I guess this would be considered the back. Yeah, nothing here. It's the hell divers. Yep, that's us. I feel like they're more spawning in the back. Well, that's where they have been spawning. But I think they might spawn over here this time. Let me see. Um, No, I don't think I'm going to rearm it. I got one more nuke left, and then I got to rearm. I think the cooldown's like three and a half minutes. So honestly, it's not too bad. And then orbital rail cannon's about to come off cooldown. So I can just use that while the while I can use the rail cannon while the 500 kilogram bomb is on cooldown. Yeah, it looks like they're coming from here again. Little taser. Yeah, come here. I'm here. We got two tasers for you, big boy. And some rockets. Didn't even get close. Yeah, they definitely gotta nerf this, uh, the taser. I think giving it unlimited ammo is crazy. Like, just for how powerful it is. 
Also, that there. Is there another one over here? No. I'm not sure if that reached it or not. I don't think it did. Oi! I don't know who threw that bomb, but that was really close. Alright, boys, let's get the fuck out of here. Okay, or you can just go full pyromaniac and just kill everything. I think I'll save my mech suit for, uh... Grab. Oh, wait. No, no, no. It's stuck to him. It's stuck to him. Okay, no idea how we survived that, but I will gladly take it. Okay, let's get out of here, lads. So what do we gotta do? No, we gotta go straight down. And Patriot Suit is off cooldown. Nice. I'll call it when I get closer to the objective. Because right now, we'll just try to avoid any massive units that we come across. Like that there, I want to try to avoid that, but I don't think we'll be able to. Does S1 have the taser? Yeah, he does have the taser. Okay. So we can definitely fry him to death. Oh, that's... Yeah, I guess I also got the orbital strike. Nah, they see us, man. They see us. They see him. Oh, maybe I could juke him. Yep. Oh, that dude's getting fucked. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Where'd he go? He just whipped around like a ragdoll. Okay, let's go around everything. Not that we can't handle it all, but it just makes it... Like, us saving all of our stuff for the extraction makes extracting a lot easier. What do I have? Uh, nothing off cooldown. You know what? We're already here. Might as well call in the next the mech suit. Please don't draw his attention. I would like to get into this with as little problems as possible. Okay, he's not facing me, so I don't really... I don't want to just start shooting at its back. Okay. He got folded. Hey! Oh! Damn, that was close. Okay, I need a... I need to look ahead of me. I keep looking back. Alright, guys. Let's go. Let's go. I think we cleared out all of the big guys behind us. for you guys. Oh, okay, never mind. There's still one. Too far away. Ah, I mean... Nah, he's not too far away. We're going for that snipe. That was right on the money. Come on, another right on the money? No. Now we're just wasting. Oh, shit. Come on, look at me. Come on, stop missing. There we go. Where'd the other one go? Oh, what the? No idea where that one came from. Okay, but I missed one rocket. Okay, I'm out. Boys, I don't got the facilities for this. Okay, now I just gotta use the minigun to try to kill all the weaker guys. Yeah, since I'm out of bullets, not bullets, but I'm out of rockets, it's kind of all I can do right now. Get away from the chargers before those guys kill me. Oh man, don't turn around.
Yeah, so now I'm just trying to cover my teammates so that they can call in some airstrikes for the, the Wild Titan and the Charger. Which is funny, because normally I run out of uh, bullets before missiles. Oh, damn. Okay, no, I gotta get out of this here. 500 kilogram bomb. Throw that right there. Run for the hills. Right on him. That's the shmoney shot. Oh, damn. We got anything else for this guy? I guess the arc charger. No, 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 no. Do not deflect. Hit him. No, you get away from me. I'm dealing with other stuff. I'm currently busy. Hey, we busted him open. Okay, I don't want to tase you. Okay, we gotta get some nades down here. Oi! Oh shit, okay. SMG time. Look at that, just was it a couple shots? Oh damn. It's really hard not to tase anybody. Get some, get some! Come on, just die already. You know, we gotta gain some distance. Come on. Yeah, yeah, get some distance here. I should have called that in. Oh. Two circles around him. Five hundred kilogram bomb. Two chargers. Bio Titan. This guy is not dying, like he is eating them. Shit, there's another one. I got you, my guy. I'm hoping you can land on him. Damn. <laughs> Just got obliterated. Okay, let's toss some nades over there. There's a lot of guys. You will never destroy our way of life. Good. Oh, I'm getting... I'm getting cut off from my teammates. Come on, run. We gotta outrun these guys. Oh, damn! Grenade. Oh, damn, that got me. That's not bad. I only died once so far. I think I died only once. Come on, land right on him. Oh, that didn't kill him. That did not kill him at all. Oh, shit. Definitely get the reinforcements. I should have another big bomb on... Nope, I do not. Come on, get up, get up. Why are we on the ground? Oh! I think we just gotta run away from this. We gotta, like, hold back, kill everything, and then call it back in. So let me try to get as much distance as possible. Oh, shit. Bro, I just spawned in, like, the worst spot. Okay, okay, let's gain some distance. Let's get our arc thrower back. Toss a grenade on you. Do I have anything? No, 45 seconds. Damn. You guys can distract them, that would be lit. And I could just tase them all to death. Oh, 
Oh no, he's too big. Shit. 14 more seconds. Did I just blow his head off? I'll take that. Let's toss. Oh, come on. Get you right up there. Oh, come on. Come on, time it, time it. Yes, let's go. There you go. That's how you get through a hell dive with this build. Oh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video.